I presented in Astro uh, our work over the past few years on developing digital pathology AI tools for prostate cancer. So we basically, uh, I basically showed data from two different projects. One of them is developing a prognostic biomarker for prostate cancer, which shows for patients with untreated prostate cancer who will do well and who will not do well and this is uh this has been recently published in uh in a uh, in a paper in nature digital medicine and it showed that patients uh, could be stratified based on um, digital pathology ai biomarkers into those who have a high risk of recurrence and those who have low risk of recurrence and that biomarker has been uh, uh approved has been included in the um, in the nc and guidelines that were just published last month. And the second part of the of the of the talk was about developing a predictive biomarker for prostate cancer. And predictive means it can predict who will respond to a certain treatment. And we focused on those patients who uh, who will need radiation. And the question was, do they benefit from adding hormone therapy to the treatment? And we showed that we can we using AI we can identify the patient who will benefit from radiation therapy plus hormone therapy and those who will not need hormonal therapy and so we showed data from both uh, for both but prognostic and predictive biomarkers and using ai tools and i argued that uh, there are still lots of channel challenges to applying AI, ai tools in the clinic but they are coming and we'll just have to deal with them and we'll just have to lead the way with the science and the clinical applications